So I'm coming to you today because I have a whole ton of stuff to haul and there is no way that I can do this in a single video. <laughs> There's no way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break it up into more than one video. It's a lot. So I hope that you enjoy haul videos because this is one of them. <laughs> Thanks for joining me and let's get into it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I am filming a series of hauls so I can try and get through some of my stuff and share it with you and then start using it in other videos. <laughs> so I wanted to share this haul with you. I went to Marshall's for the first time the other day and I got this humongous bag. Oh my God, it's huge. Um, oh, it's crazy. Okay. So I normally shop at like Ross or TJ Maxx, but recently I started watching these videos of people doing hauls at Marshall's and I thought, okay, I'll give it a try. So I just want to share with you some of the goodies that I picked up. So the first thing I want to share, and this is in no particular order, you guys, I'm just kind of grabbing stuff. It says in the tag it's $4.99 and there's a set of five mesh body sponges. I like them because they're nice, bright, and cheery and I can... Um, replace them easily. So I go through a lot of soap and body wash and stuff and it's nice to be able to have some extra sponges on hand for when I run out or when I wear out the ones that I already have. Uh, while I was there I found these candles. So they're called ear candles for candling if you're familiar. They were $9.99 and you use these to clean the wax out of your ear. It's kind of um, a process. So I've used them before though and I really, I like them so I wanted to grab them and I thought $9.99 is a good price because I think at like Whole Foods it's $15.99 for a box or something. While I was there I saw this Isaac Mizrahi brush. It was $4.99 and this is what it looks like. It's really very nice. It's really well packaged. I think part of the reason I was attracted to it is even though it's not picking up on camera, the packaging has polka dots on the side. So I just wanted to see what this brush was like and it's really pretty and yeah. So I grabbed that. Um, I also picked up some, let's see, what's this? So I grabbed the Honey Moisture Foot Mask. It's a self-care foot moisture mask. There's five pairs that are in here and this was $7.99. And since I like to use masks on my feet and I use masks on my face, I thought it would be nice to get a new set of masks that I've never tried before. I also went ahead and grabbed these Kala foot moisturizing masks. One is a soothing foot mask, the other one's moisturizing. One's in tea tree and the other is in lavender and they both were $4.99 each. And what else is in here? Oh, there are some more masks. So I'm familiar with this company. This is Innisfree. And they had several packages of the face masks, like the, you know, little disposable ones. This kind. Oh my gosh, that's so bright. Is it even showing up on camera? I hope so. So this pack is the green tea. And that's what it looks like. And this is a water type mask. Um, I like Innisfree. I think it's a really good brand. So I'm totally comfortable buying a whole big old pack of masks from them. And then the pack was $9.99. Like I said, they had a whole bunch of different types. They had like honey, they had pomegranate, something else. Um, and actually I think a couple more than that. But these are the two I grabbed. This one is the cucumber and this is an essence type mask. So I grabbed one water and one essence and since I use masks every day I know that I'll probably blow right through those two packages no problem because there's 10 in a pack. Um, what else did I grab? Alright so this I thought was a steal. This is the Ahava Dead Sea Water Mineral Hand Cream in pack Cactus and Pink Pepper and it was $6.99 for this bottle. 
and that's what it looks like and um, this stuff is normally really expensive so I don't know if they maybe mislabeled it or if Marshalls really does just have really good deals but yeah I grabbed this off the shelf real quick I was like yeah that belongs to me I'm buying that thank you um, I did see the Vita Liberata Advanced Organics Moisture Boost Body Moisturizer, and I'm surprised that this was at Marshall's. This is kind of a nice brand, but it was $6.99 for the pack, and it is 6.6 .6 fluid ounces, so I thought I'll give it a try, and this is what the bottle looks like. And since I go through a lot of um, moisturizer and body butters and lotion, it's it's never going to be enough. I'm always going to need more lotion. Um, I also grabbed... Take some of this stuff out of here so I can see what I'm doing. Um, it's kind of a hodgepodge, isn't it? There's a lot of like, not knickknacks and doodads, but something similar. So I grabbed these... These are the, um, what is this company called again? Philosophy. And they are the like shower, bath, and hair something. Oh, shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. I would use these just for like bathing. Um, but this, these both were on my wish list, I think so, at Ulta. And they were only $10.99 each. And so they do retail at Ulta for $20 each. So I thought that was a steal. This one is called Paradise Girl. It's a tropical fruit colada shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. Um, and that's this one here. And then this one is called Passion Fruit Daiquiri. And it's the same thing. It's a shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. It's really bright pink, too. <laughs> So I'm excited about using those, and I, again, cannot believe that they were only $10.99. I don't know how Marshalls gets away with it. I mean, that was my first time shopping there, but now I can see why people are like, oh, I'm going to Marshalls. It's like, yeah, I bet you are. I bet you're going to Marshalls, aren't you? Um, they had more Innisfree, so I grabbed these. They're exactly the same thing. It's the Green Tea Foam Cleanser, and again, Innisfree is a brand that I really like a lot, so when I saw these, I knew I had to have them. And they were only $8.99. So, yeah, you better believe I was grabbing those. Um, I also found these little makeup brush cleaners by Beauty Concepts. I thought the bottles are really, really cute. So here's one of them. And then here's the other one. And I, um, I'm a little obsessive when it comes to my brushes. Like, I only use them once and then I clean them. <laughs> <laughs> that's kind of how it goes. So I use them, I pop them in my little bowl over here, and then I clean them, and then I dry them, and then I use them again. I don't always um, use like a brush cleaner in between. That's more for if I'm just trying to like, you know, make a succession of looks or use a brush like multiple times, then I'll, you know, use the cleaner. Like, um, what do I use? This stuff right here. What's it called? In between, so I'll use Perry and Spirit, you know, in between, and just kind of for a spot clean on my brushes. But I really prefer to actually clean my brushes. So, yep, there's that. And then I grabbed these um, little chip clips. They were five dollars ninety nine, and we have a lot of chips here at this house. <laughs> we all like chips, so I'm constantly having to get chip clips because they do up and disappear. Um, I have a couple more items here, and let's see. So, first, I got something for the kitchen. It's $3.99. It's just one of those little drain things that you put, you know, inside so the food and what have you doesn't fall in there. We have a garbage disposal, but you know what? The kids are always putting stuff in there where it falls down, so I'd rather just use this so there's no forks, spoons, knives, or anything else that's in there. Um, clogging up the drain or needing to get fixed. And then I also grabbed this card. I really liked it. I thought it was so pretty. And it was only $2.99 and it says showering you with love. Can you see that? Isn't that nice? 
I walked in and saw that and I just felt so represented. Yay! <laughs> Love it. So I'm excited to give that to someone special for the holiday for uh, Valentine's Day. Alright, so I have two items left here. This one is a Saurus Beauty. It's like a little two-tier stackable cosmetic organizer. And it was only $9. Oops, is it focusing? I'm sorry, guys. It was only $9.99. So I'm going to use this to try and organize my table over here a little bit better for when I'm doing videos. Because right now, I'm just grabbing stuff like a mad woman, just reaching out, grabbing whatever. So... Yeah, it'd be nice to be a little more organized. The last item I grabbed, I couldn't believe they even had this. I was really surprised. It's the Tammy um, and Makeup Revolution Tropical Twilight Shadow Palette, this one. I saw, I think it was Too Much Mouth. She was using this. I think this is the one, and she was swearing by it. I mean, the look that she made was pretty, so I was like, hey. Um, but more importantly, this was only $7.99. If you go to Ulta, I think it's like, I don't know, $15.99 or something like that. Something like that. Something I didn't want to pay for it, I can tell you that much. But uh, $7.99, I could definitely, I could pay $7.99 for it. So I'm going to bust out this palette and I'll do a look in another video. Um, yeah, that's it. That's everything. Wow. Lots of stuff for my first time at Marshalls. I had a really good time shopping. Um, yeah, they, they have a lot of high quality products for good prices. So I will be shopping with them again. Anyways, thank you so much for joining me. I hope everybody's well and healthy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you have found at Marshall's. If you shop there, like what should I be looking for? What has been your um, favorite find at Marshall's? Let me know in the comments. All right, you guys, I'll talk to you soon and take care.